It's a real pleasure um, for us to be working with uh, Southampton Football Club, our local Premiership club, uh, working in particular uh, with the junior players at the club to help them learn a lot more about their bodies and how to prevent uh, sports injuries and working with the senior players to ensure that they're in top condition uh, to compete in the Premiership. Um, it's a great example of the way in which we all the time are looking for ways in which we can bring the science and discovery from our university to benefit in our local community uh, and to benefit more widely. Uh, work in the university has been excellent, very um, beneficial for us. We have processes, we have ways that we audit our results and the university brings an academic robustness to it. So we can objectively uh, measure what we do and our results and try and refine those and those ultimately those results go into to the public arena by the medical world, the scientific medical world, to improve the care of not just football players, the general public and improve the knowledge of medicine. The aim of the research is to prevent problems with injuries developing into osteoarthritis and an example is hip pain in professional footballers and it's a very common problem. Um, and so we want to find out um, why it happens in the first place and so that we can actually prevent it progressing and affecting the, their playing career but also very importantly preventing osteoarthritis later in life. I think if it can help any individual then I think it's massively important. Um, obviously I didn't even know how good I could be physical wise until I was 27, 28 and if I could have had the treatment at 13, 14, 15, then I think it would have helped me massively. So yeah, I think it's massively important and it'll improve so many people's chances of succeeding. In the biomechanics lab here, we have a, a Vicon motion capture system, um, which we use to analyze the players' movements as they walk up and down and perform various tasks uh, in the lab. So we attach uh, reflective markers to specific locations on the players' bodies and then we have a series of cameras set up around the room um, that then track those markers in 3D. Uh, we then take that data and then analyse all the different joint angles and, and movements that the players perform. My purpose is to look at control um, around the hip area which I measure just observing um, those movements, seeing if they've got control or no control. We're trying to see if we can find ways and tests that we can use in clinics so to um, assess these um, footballers easier and trying to um, kind of pick up these dysfunctions at an earlier stage so that you know we can prevent any further um, injuries in the future. This is a, a centre that involves seven universities. It's the first of its kind in the UK in that it brings together experts in osteoarthritis as well as sports medicine and sports science. I think the University of Southampton have been superb for trying to care for footballers. If they can get a chance to help fellow professionals, I think it'll be only for the good. 